in the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, one God. Amen. How are you today? Today we are going to talk about Saint Maximus and his brother Dumedius. Saint Maximus, he was older than his brother, and his father was the king of the country. And they raised up in castle because their father was the king. So the king raised these two sons in a holy and Christian manner. They were full of purity and holiness, always praying and reading the holy books. And one day, they took a decision to leave the castle because they thinking about to be amongst and live in the desert with Jesus. They went to Syria to Saint Agabius and Saint Agabius teached them how to live with Jesus Christ as a monk. And they stayed about six years with Saint Arabius. And one day, Saint Arabius told them to go to Saint Macarius in Egypt. So they listened to him and they went to Egypt. After a long trip, they arrived to Egypt and they met Saint Macarius. And they told him, that they wanted to live with him and be his disciples. When Saint Macarius saw that they were rich, he thought that they would not be able to live in the desert. But they told him, This is true, we are the children of the king and we raised up in castle, but we choose by ourselves to live with Jesus in the desert and to be a monk. So Saint Macarius, he gave them a shovel and asked them to dig a cave for them in a solid rock. So they live inside this cave and worship Jesus Christ. Then they lived in this cave near Saint Macarius around three years. On those three years, they never meet anyone. They only went to church on Sundays to partake of the Holy Communion silently. Saint Macarius prayed to God and asked him to show him about Saint Maximus and Saint Medeus so he went to them to visit them and bless them. And he told them he will stay tonight with them. So he make himself sleep. When he woke up at midnight, as was his custom to pray, he saw the two saints praying and a ray of light like a fire, going from their mouths to heaven, and the angels protect them. So when he see that, he said, wow, those are really saints. See how is the prayer coming from their mouths and go to the heaven looks like light or fire. Thank God to let me make sure they worship you right. After they finished the prayer, Saint Macarius blessed them and asked them to pray for him. And Saint Maximus and Saint Matthias, they were very humble. And they looked down and they told him, you pray for us, Saint Macarius. After that, God rewarded them in the heaven. May their prayers be with us, and glory be to God forever.
Amen. Pray for me and see you next time. Bye.